this is just a quick tutorial on uh, or some notes I guess on a really easy way to put the piston back in the cylinder reassemble it without having taken the piston off the conrod uh, with the we all know the difficulties of or well, the pain involved in trying to insert a piston in a cylinder with the rings one by one well, Rotax came up with this tool piston ring spanner which looks like it's been honed out of an old piston liner slot in there for the conrod thick at the top tapered inside so thin and smooth in the middle at the bottom lightly oiled it uh, as well as that my super tools are a bit of old timber and a hacksaw blade so this shows just how simple it is just wind the piston down to the bottom lightly oiled inside conrod gap at the back just jiggle it on literally a little bit of a jiggy jiggy little bit of head protruding from the top to ease the locating of the cylinder voila bit of timber on the on there cylinder assembly on just wind the piston up blade under there that will just stop the spanner from falling into the engine case makes it easier to retrieve and on the top of the head wind the piston up there and voila take that out take that out that's in just exactly how easy was that for your information there's a 500 one as well these are quite hard to get now the 500 ones Rotax don't do them anymore uh, Nick at Force has got some, maybe LMS. Um, these are a little bit more tricky because they won't come in and out because they're too big. So all we have to do with that is wind it in. There it is. So on your 500 engine, you can do it. You can still get it out by um, winding it off the conrod like that.